We've been working on the frame now for around five weeks and uh, have undertaken the majority of the cleaning and are now uh, working on uh, replacing ornament and in painting areas of loss. The structure of the frame is made of wood. Um, it's composed of laminated planks of soft wood that are shaped to give the profile of the frame. The ornament is applied composition and composition is a glue-based moulding material that when it's warm it's dough-like in consistency and can be pressed into moulds. Then the surface is gilded and that means it has a layer of extremely thin gold leaf on the surface so it's a fraction of a micron and that's applied to the surface using various techniques. The frame was made in 1873 by W.A. Smith, a London-based frame maker. We have the, a copy of the original invoice for the frame and uh, the cost of the frame plus the original stretcher amounted to 30 pounds, which even in those days seems a relatively small amount considering the size of the, the frame, uh, its complex structure and the high quality finishes used. Where there were areas of flaking gilding or loose ornament, um, these were stabilised using appropriate adhesives on the area. Also where we have very obvious uh, areas of ornament loss, um, they've been replaced. Um, so what we've done is taken a mould using a dental product of an existing area and then used uh, pressed composition into the mould to recreate the piece. And then these areas um, are gilded uh, and toned to match the surrounding. The next stage in the process is, over the next few days, is completing the treatment of the frame, the final cleaning um, and toning in of the in gilding. Then the uh, frame and painting will be removed from the plinth, the plinth will be dismantled. Uh, the next stage will be that the frame will be assembled. And um, brought to an upright position and the painting will be rehoused in the frame and secured in the frame. And this is a very delicate process involving a whole team of people. The next stage, of course, will be hanging this massive work onto the wall. The frame will be supported with additional brackets uh, underneath it because of its massive weight, as well as being secured at the sides and the top onto the wall. That will complete after two months the Conservation Live project and once again the frame and painting will be reunited and on display on the walls of the gallery.